Hey everyone, I'm Ari Olin. We're back to another episode of Ari Olin's Heart Rate Gaming. We're back to Fallout 4. And we are gonna go, we are in Good Neighbor, and we're gonna go talk to uh, Bobby No Nos, which was a job rumor we heard while we were walking through uh, Good Neighbor. So we're gonna go and do that job. Hey, you. Looking for work? Yeah, when can I start? Well... Aren't you an eager beaver? If you don't mind a little manual labor, and don't ask too many questions, you're in. I'll give you 50 caps to start. <sighs> Interested? 50 caps? You can do better than that. Trust me, Aww. there will be much more later on. Just take the 50 caps. <sighs> I'm in. That's what I like to hear. Let's go inside. Ah! I'll give you the lowdown. All right, let's go. Ready to get to work? Yep, what do you got? No, I followed you down here for the exercise. Funny. Well, you'll get plenty of exercise here. You are going to be doing some digging. Uh, okay. <laughs> Waste of talent. I'm your girl. No one likes a brown noser. The other two are down there digging already. Can't please her no matter what I say. Hand, will you? Yeah, whatever, fine. So down we go. Well, what are you waiting for? Nothing. Get digging. In we go. Oh. Some interesting sound. Hey, I think we can finally get through. Want to see what's on the other side? Oh, yeah. You think Bobby will pay us this week? I don't know, man. It's starting to feel like a human chair. Did you just hear something? It's crawling with my alerts. Fail! Bobby can take this job and shove it. Good luck down there, new girl. Oh, thanks. So there's my alerts. Great. Let's go deal with some Meyer lurks. Oh yeah, I see them. Soft shell ones. Ah! Oh, I do not like Meyer lurks. Get away! my favorite give me your tender meat oh you can't get past your friend huh why was that Meyer like carrying a screwdriver he's the handy hand and smiler oh oh I made a mess talk to Bobby Oh, is she gonna come down here since her workers just ran past her? Got it. Oh. What Bobby. is going on in my tunnel? A lot. Why are lurks? Let's be sarcastic. Looks like we are having crab for dinner tonight. Yeah. You eat my lurk? Ugh, no. Disgusting. Tough, but somehow slimy at the same time. Well, you stuck around at least. So I guess you're promoted. You get to be my new gun. I think we just quick. need one more guy. An old friend. He'll want a fair cut, but we saw what being cheap got me. Um, okay. Who is this guy? He's just the guy we need to speed things along. Likes gadgets, money, and not much else. First, I think it's best if you actually see what we're after. I have some things to check on in Diamond City. Diamond Head over City? To the noodle shop there, and I'll meet you when I finish up my business. Okay, so now we have to go to Diamond City. There you are. <laughs> Was wondering if you were going to show up. Yes, it's me. I have to hide my face in these parts. People like me aren't allowed around here. Now let's get down to business. 
That big wall of glass looming over Diamond City is the mayor's office. Most people don't know it, but there's a strong room buried beneath. Mayor's just sitting on top of it. And that's our target. The guy has it coming, if you ask me. With how he treats my kind, maybe he deserves worse. Um, okay. What's inside? Caps, meds, food. Enough to keep this city running. It's things we want. Things everyone wants. You get in on this, there's plenty for you. You got it? So, what do you say we make this party a little bigger? I managed to track down my tech guy. His name's Mel. And he is right here in Diamond City. Okay. The guy can make a gadget to solve any problem. Thing is, he's a bit locked up right now. Oh, great. Well, you have to get him out of there. I can't just stroll into Diamond City security with this face, covered or not. All right. You really think we need this guy? Trust me, this is the guy we need. Pick a lock, find a key, bribe the guard. The usual stuff. Just get him out of there. Oh. Security barracks is, or office is over here. Alright. Who do we gotta bribe? I mean, I guess I could put on my uh, dress and glasses and see if there's a persuasion option. Yeah, I'm ready to do some target. <laughs> Just in case. Hi! You and your mercenary friend keep your guns in your pants. Yeah, whatever. Officer? You got something to say? Yeah, what did Mel do? Why is Mel in here? Him? He was caught trying to reprogram the robot bartender at the tap house to give him free drinks. <laughs> Just between you and me, I would totally do that if I knew how. Let him out! I was hoping to get Mel out of lockup. No way. Ah, uh, come it's on. service time just like everyone else. Uh, come on, dude. Work with me here. Why do you gotta be such a punk? Hi. Mel here. Can I help you? Do you come here often? Yeah. Just come here to unwind. Nothing more relaxing than a sparsely furnished jail cell. So I'm guessing you're here because you need something from me. Um, totally unrelated. But I hear that there's an old glitched out Protectron unit back there. Guards asked me to take a look, but it was a real head scratcher. Couldn't do a thing. Oh boy, so he's he Heard was... you rescued Valentine. Good work. Well, sense scared the hell out of me. But Nikki, he ain't like those Institute psychos. He wants me to activate a glitch out protector. I guess at this point, I don't have any other option but to either activate this protectron and release him in the chaos or what? To pickpocket one Officer. of them? Officer. You got something to say? Uh, I don't want to bribe you. That's too expensive. I was hoping to get... No way. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I'm not detected. You're detected. Last mistake. Ah, <laughs> oh, no! Let my pretty dress! All right, we're just gonna try it again. Let's try Officer? persuading him again. You got something to say? Yeah, hey. I was hoping to get Mel out of lockup. No way. Oh, man. Whoops. Forty-six percent chance. Hey, they didn't need that anyway. I got it. I got it. Get out of the way. I picked your pocket. Oh, wow. Let's just get out of here. Yeah, let's just go. Quick. Run, dude. Run. There we go. Thanks for getting me out, I guess. So, 
You're Bobby's new toy. I'm nobody's toy. Yeah, this year's hottest gift. Get one before they're gone. I don't really do the whole gift thing. That would require having friends or family. That woman doesn't have a patient bone in her body. I wasn't serving a life sentence here. What, you couldn't <laughs> wait like a day? What's the job? How'd you like to help break into the Diamond City strong room? Well, damn. That's a big score. There'd be enough caps there to keep me going for a long time. Bobby may be shady, but she always pays up in the end. So, I guess I'll get my stuff and head over to her place. Yep. All right. Meet the gang in the dig. Okay, so now we have to go back to... Uh, good name. All right, we're back at the dig. Let's see what... Bobby wants from us now. Got yourself into trouble again, Mel. Whoa. What can I say? All right. I learned from the best. All here. Mel, you want to introduce your little friend? Yep. Meet Sonia. This little bot is going to help us move through the earth like a mole rat on jet. Sweet. I'm excited to see what she can do. <laughs> I can't wait to show you. She's one of a kind. <laughs> I modified her radio systems to emit sonic pulses at frequencies that can loosen any sediment around. Wow. Mel says we'll be able to get to the strong room ten times faster than just digging. And it's a hell of a lot safer than loading this place up with dynamite. All right, guys, get ready. I'm not completely sure how this place will respond. So, uh, brace yourselves. Sonia, do your thing. <laughs> so, what's the deal with the new girl? Oh, I got lucky with this one. Came right up to my door and took the job. She takes orders and she's useful in a fight. <laughs> what more I want? She seems to have a good head on her shoulders. Maybe we don't burn bridges this time. Yeah. All right. So onward. Okay, well we leveled up, so let's see what we can get. <laughs> Wish I had that earlier. Okay, so can't get any of those until 18, 26, 28, oh, 16, I can get that on the next level. Action Girl might be pretty nice. All right, we're gonna go Action Girl this time. Creedy. I hear it. Oh, oh. Dude. Yeah. Now we're just starting to have fun. Eyes on my back. I knew someone was there. around here. Woo! <laughs> uh. Uh. Die, hatchlings! How do I get up there? I want that. going to last long in all this radiation. Ugh! Usually, core is worth it. All right. Uh, Over here, Mel. Gotcha, Sonia. Oh, there's two. There's two fragile walls. Ah. Mel, get Sonia over here. No problem. Come on, Sonia. Okay, let's see. Uh oh. Oh, that thing looks strong. Myler King. You're messing with the best. Am I even 
hitting it? What? Uh, oh, for goodness sakes. Uh-oh. It mutated! What's its resistance is? Oh my goodness, it's got a lot. <laughs> All right, so I've only got one shot with this, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna try. Oh come on! Did that work? I don't know about you. This seems like a dead end to me. Did it work? Backtrack and blast another path. It worked. Take that! Mini nuke for the win! Whoa. So there's a suit of power armor in here. Ah. Maybe I should take it? I'm not sure. All right, let's see what that armor was. Cavalier's leather right arm reduces damage while blocking or sprinting by 15%. So this place is pretty much all close quarters combat. All right, I guess I'm gonna try to take this. Most of the fights in here are Meyer lurks anyway, so it's all gonna be close quarters. Missing an arm and a leg. All right, onward. Let's do this quickly so I don't burn through my fusion core too fast. I hear more Meyer lurks. Where are they at? There they go. Trust anything that looks that perfectly preserved after 200 years. Uh, 
But it looks so good. Through the walls. Oh, there's some hatchlings. Stop that. Stop that. Stupid babies. Die. Little skitterbugs. has a Geiger counter equipped. I'll just keep my ears open for Clinton's. I don't want to nerd out. Okay, so... Out over it, but a Robco Pip-Boy is a rare find. You're gonna have to let me play this way. What the- Oh, Hunter! Oh, two Hunters! Eight at the face! Come on! Oh, I hate it when it does that. Lobsters! Well, they're fighting each other. Fighting each other. Die, you overgrown lobster. And all this shellfish is making me hungry. Oh, come on, you're a better shot than this. Got him! Alright, there's another fusion core in there. else you wanted to check out in this tunnel. I suggest you do that first. Doubts? It just doesn't seem like we're under Diamond City, does it? I don't think Bobby's telling us everything about this job. Up to you. I say we keep moving. 
Ready, Sonia? Okay. Yes. Woo! Alright, let's save before things most likely go very wrong. Bobby. Great. Now my socks are wet. Well, guys, we're right under the Diamond City strong room. You sure this is the right place? I've been mapping it out, and I think Diamond City should be a little further north of here. I don't have a doubt in my mind. How about a little trust for the boss? <laughs> Tell the truth, Bobby. Where are we? Under the Diamond City strong room. And that last time I'm saying it. We still need a way to get up there, though. Mel, you think your robot will work here? Look at this place. The foundation is already crumbling. One blast from Sonya, and I bet the floor above will come right down. Well, then make it so. He won't want to be in the room for this collapsing foundation and all. Good thinking. All right, then. Everybody clear out. Sonya, prepare yourself for a blast at maximum power. Ah. Ah. All right. Ready. Ready. Here we okay. go. That didn't sound good. okay. Now let's get up into that stroke, shall we? No, no, no. Oh, Sonya, Sonya, no! We have But you can make another robot with a hull we get from the strong. Keep your head in the game. Ah, oh, poor Sonya. I'm beginning to wonder what we're going to find in that strong room. If there are dead bodies in there or something. <laughs> What's the story with you and Bobby? Well, she swears she used to work with my grandfather when he was about my age. She courted me at the bar in Good Neighbor and kept telling me how I looked just like her dead friend. <laughs> yeah, and she was also my great aunt's neighbor's pharmacist. Yeah, well, laugh all you want. I didn't care if it was true. I was just glad to get to do something with my life. I've been working with Bobby ever since, and only regretted it occasionally. All right, all right up we go. Let's see where she's led us. Uh, looks like just a junky storehouse. And there's a tibia in that box. Nothing like a good old tibia. Okay. Ah, here we go. Strong room! Let's go! Save! Your scheme. He took you in, Bobby. And you're stealing from him? Don't listen to her. All right. Let's see what you have to say for yourself. <laughs> Mel was right. This isn't Diamond City. So what? This doesn't change anything. It is still the same job. I see the rest of you are in the dark about this. Nice no nos. You all just broke into Hancock's storeroom. You know. Hancock. The mayor of Good Neighbor. Oh, Damn no. it, Bobby. Listen, guys. I know this isn't what you expected. But there are still a ton of caps on the line here. Help me take her out, and all of it is ours. This is Hancock we're ripping off here. The guy tends to hold grudges. Counter offer. Just go back into your tunnel, and we can forget this ever happened. What do you say? <laughs> well, I'm gonna fail, but... Come on, Bobby. At least if we leave now, we leave with our lives. I haven't come this far to run oh. away with my tail between my legs. You are either with me or against me. <sighs> what is this about, Bobby? Why did you lie to us? I knew no one in their right mind would help me rip off Hancock. 
Everyone is so damn afraid of him, is so damn in love with him. He thinks he is invincible. I wanted to show him he wasn't. And get killed in the process? You lied to us, Bobby. And you have to pay. You can't do this to me. This isn't how this is supposed to go. No, yeah, what? well. Fine. More for me. Oh, really? You could take it on all by yourself? Is that how you think this is gonna go? Oh, that thing exploded in my face! Whoa. Are they really just gonna stand there and just watch this play out? That's how they're gonna do it! You were supposed to be my friend, Bobby. Why are you such a jerk? You're such a jerk. You're a liar and a punk. Where's my caps? Ow. Ow. Yeah, poke your head out. Do it. Poke it. Poke it further. Further! Oh, come on! 78% chance that I miss? How? This will be easy. Will it? Will it really? Because, you know, as soon as you uh, get done with us, you're just going to have to deal with the other people's, too. I can't believe they're just standing there watching this play out. They're like, yep, this is interesting. This is a nice little fight. I doubt it. Damn, I'm getting rad. Seriously? I'm not really cool with how this went down. Sorry, Mel. Mel. What a waste of time. Sorry, Mel. Hi. Hey there. You made the right move. <laughs> How did you find us? If you think Hancock doesn't know about everything that happens in his territory, you're mistaken. You have to know you guys weren't exactly silent down there. <laughs> I'm not so sure. Well, I'm still itching for a fight, if you change your mind. Here, take this. A token for doing the right thing. Wow, Ashmaker. Sets target on fire for 15 points of damage, and it's a minigun. That's pretty Hancock awesome. I'll be happy to hear about your loyalty. Look at that to Strong. You should go pay your respects in person. It's best to stay on Hancock's good side. Trust me. Yeah, trust you, sure. All right, so now we can go talk to Hancock about everything. Everything that went down. We're back to Hancock, so let's go uh, talk to him and see what he has to say about the whole storeroom thing. Hancock. Well, if it ain't Bobby's little Patsy. Here, for protecting my stash. Wise decision putting Bobby down like that. <laughs> Didn't exactly have a choice, now did I? That's what's great about being the mayor. You're always the safe bet. <sighs> Let me tell you, this classy little dry corner hat of mine is getting heavy. Am I turning into the man? Some kind of tyrant? I spend all my time putting down the people I would have been proud to scheme with just a few years ago. I need to take a walk again. Get a grip on what really matters. Living free. Can you just leave, good neighbor? Aren't you the mayor? Hey, the mayor's still the mayor whether he's in residence or not. I've walked out of here plenty of times. Keeps me honest. Can't let power get to my head. That's not what being in charge of good neighbor is about. If you're heading out, why not come with me? Yeah, I like it. You might just be the right kind of trouble. Let me just have a little chat with my community first. Give them the news. Yeah. Hancock is going to come with us now. All right, let's go hear this speech. Hey, everybody, gather up. 
I got something you all need to hear. No rush. Everyone just take your time. Look, everyone, I'm taking a walk. It's time for your fearless leader to get back out there. Mix it up in the... I forget what that feels like. You can't leave, Hancock. We need you. Hey, I'm always going to be here in spirit, my man. Good neighbor and I, we got a connection. But like any hot and heavy relationship, sometimes you got to spend time apart. Let things cool off. Remind yourself of who you are. So that's why I'm leaving. I'm still your mayor. I'm still gonna be here when you need me. But it's time for me to stop living so damn comfortable. Because we all know, no one in power deserves to be comfortable for long. Now, what's the best town in the Commonwealth? Where can someone live free with no judgment? Good neighbor! Good neighbor. Of, of the, the people! people. Oh, for the people. the people! And don't let no one forget it. Right. There he is. Jeez, dude! Stop teleporting from buildings! Alright. Now we can talk to Hancock. Hey, Hancock. So, you ready to get this show on the road? Sure! Are you still interested in traveling together? I think I could do with some more trouble in my life. Let's do it. Done. Hancock! That was the coolest ghoul in the Commonwealth. Hey, McCready. Don't wait up. Okay. And I'm just gonna get McCready back again. There you are. I almost thought you forgot about me. Time to hit the road. Finally came to your senses, huh? McCready, huh? That's a hell of a gun to have at your back. I aim to please. There's no squirt to spill in blood if uh. the person ain't earned it. Lucky for us, the Commonwealth provides. Sanctuary Hills is gonna need another bed. Okay. Well, we didn't get as far as I was hoping we would. That quest was a lot longer than I remember it being. <sighs> All right. So we're gonna wrap this up right here. We now have Hancock as our companion and Next time we'll probably go and get Dance and talk to the Brotherhood a bit, and so that should be interesting. We'll get to see the Brotherhood. So if you're enjoying, make sure you like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. See ya!